that throughout the summer. The surf races are up next, and a start like that will be key. Getting across this bank, we've got some of the best swimmers in the business lining up here. A big field, Jack, and with waves like this, anyone can take the win. Oh, it is a big field, Josh, and these girls are going to have a huge race ahead. It will be anyone's when they come into the wave zone. I'm going to go with Georgia Miller. The way she's been swimming in the last few rounds and in that Iron Woman was great. She's going to be one hard girl to beat. Certainly is. They're on the start line and they're away. A few tactics early on. Look at the field split. Some straight in. They're not concerned. The smart ones run around the gutter and onto the back. It looks like Gemma Smith there from Yamina is in the mix. Tara Coleman as well. Jordan Mercer in the centre, absolutely flying, as is Lizzie Wellborn. But your pick, Georgia Miller, the former two-time Australian surf race champion, is showing everybody why with technique like that. Yeah, once she gets into the green water, it's going to be hard for any of these girls to stick with her. She's going to open up or try to open up a gap. But one of the girls from Northcliffe there, Josh, I don't know if you could pick up who that is, has gone with her. That looks like Alex Nolan. So former training partner up there on the Sunshine Coast. Nolan's down at the Northcliffe Club having a great swim there. So a former junior surf race medalist at the Australian titles and a former Australian champion going head-to-head. -head. So the best in the business. Great technique there, those shots from Bart Louie, unbelievable. They both stop, they smile, they know it's coming. We've got a jag and we've got a party wave. Have a look, then will they get down it? We've got one down it, that's Mercer. She's down out in front, a few butterfly strokes. What about that? I don't know if any of the other girls even went it. They all stopped and there's another one, so there's carnage. We could have anyone as the winner here. Who knows what they're doing? They've all just let it go except Mercer. That's dumbfounded. I don't know what's happened here. Why would you let the waves go? They're the ones that get you to the beach, not Jordan Mercer. She grew up here, she loves the surf, and she loves a win. What a performance from her. You take the waves and you take the wins. <laughs> Doesn't she love it? One eight hundred dollar wave. Jordan Mercer there, she gives us some body surfing technique as she runs across the line. And have a look at that. Jordan Mercer down that wave. She works her butterfly strokes tries to keep herself up above the water. And in the wash-up, Ella Heiniger finishes in second. Georgia Miller, our early leader, third on the podium. Lara Moses, Ella Brown, and Alex Nolan in the top seven. Jen Mullins, Tara Coleman, and then a few of the early race favorites, Naomi Scott, Maddie Spencer, and Lizzie Wellborn further down the list. Oh, it is good to be home with surf like this, and you're out there swimming. I tell you what, I put my foot on that start line for the swim race and, and just prayed for one of those big waves that I've been watching come in all day. And sure enough, the opportunity was there and I wasn't saying no. I was just getting to the beach as quick as I could and saw a couple of the girls around me out there. I think I might have been in fourth coming in in the swim or so. And yeah, took my chances, took them right to the sandbank.